Usually, free games are pretty ass, apart from the likes of Valorant and Fortnite, which are made by huge gaming companies. But I found a free survival game that has no DLCs, no in-game purchases, and looks beautiful. So let's see if it's actually good. Okay, welcome to Arid, the free survival game made by a university. Let's just jump straight in. Bubba, this is Tiger. Do you read me? Company said we go oh, they're in a plane. I... Uh oh. Christ. Tell my dad. Tell him what? Okay, I'm here. What's this? We got a sack and it's got a bandage. Oh God, I got busted up real good. The crates should have some first aid supplies. Here is the crate, a chuno. Hard and chewy, not much taste, but it, it'll do. It will do, you're right, we don't have much choice. I can tell straight away, there's a lot of stuff I'm gonna struggle to pronounce. Festuka. Okay, so there is a storyline in this game, as you can probably tell, and we're just gonna go ahead and follow it, and along the way, we're gonna have to try survive. That is essentially the entire premise of Arid. Before we get into this story, this was one of the hardest games I think I've ever played. Over six hours of walking, and even though it was a lot of fun, I was so close to quitting at times. So if you end up enjoying this video, consider subscribing and join my Discord in the description below. Oh, we got a note. What does it say? Roberto, Martin, Julio. I don't know their surnames. I must remember them. People in Puya Huapi must know. Maria or Maria. And you said okay. that Spanish lessons were a waste of time. Right, Dad? That had a lot of stuff. Look, we got aloe vera. We got everything. Okay. What is this? Uh, we're on the other side now. All right. Now I gotta just find what's left from my cargo. Okay, that should be easy. One thing right here, a couple bandages. Oh, this looks good. Yep, clay, unrefined wood, more clay. Already though, this doesn't feel like a free game. What can we use the shovel for? Dirt pile. Nice. And I'm guessing the way out is through here. We've got one more crate up there. We'll get this little guy and then we'll carry on. Gonna need a pickaxe. So good thing we don't have one. Where do we find a pickaxe? There it is. You see the sun exposure at the top. This game has some really super unique features. Right, let's use this pickaxe. Got three rocks. Okay, not bad. Nice. Oh, I thought it was a loading screen, but it was just pitch black. Oh, we got a book. You pulled me from the jaws of death, but I've never found your name. You deserved better. I'm sorry. Wow. I mean, the desert's harsh, man. I think we're going to find a lot of dead bodies. The arid climate, the sun intensity, and the high temperature of the Atacama Desert are the main threats for your survival. The main threat is the sun. Poor thing. Dead Vizcacha. Is that just not a bunny rabbit? Do we have space? Okay, I guess we do. Oh, look, you can just scroll down. So the weight is the only thing we need to keep an eye out on. That makes everything a lot easier. Looks like someone was staying here recently. I hope they don't mind me squatting. I'll be honest, they probably do, unless they're dead. A workbench. Oh, hold on. This thing's just got interesting. A knife. Is that worth it? Screw it. <laughs> Let's do it. Butcher Viscacha. Fine. You know what? Let's do it. I'm going to go to bed. Let's sleep. Wow, okay, this is a system I've never seen before. So our energy's depleting really, really quickly. Our hydration, I mean. And hunger. You want know save and wake up. There we go. Yeah, we need to drink quickly, though. Do we have stuff on us? We don't. Well, we can use this. Okay, sorted. Now I need the food that I stored in this box. I want to cook up some food. Just so that I can say I cook some food. And we'll use unrefined wood. Those are the craziest cooking sound effects I think I've ever seen in a game. How is this free? Like, actually, how is it free? <laughs> this was literally made by a bunch of students at a university. And it's of higher quality than most games I've played. It's an alive bunny rabbit or viscacha. It actually is a different animal, I think. We can pet it. Hey. Oh, <laughs> aren't you adorable? And probably pretty tasty. What do we need? We need cloth. Some metal hook. Oh, strong rope. That is one thing we need. What is the other thing, though? Oh, we have enough. Okay, well, let's... Jesus. Bit of rope burn, maybe? What is this? That's a mine shaft. Oh, my. Okay. Yeah, we're not going down there. Let's just check this place out. What if we got a bed, a crafting table, chest with not much, a bit of metal scrap, actually. That might be good for us. I'll take that for cloth. Thank you. Sons, 
burning me up. We need shade. Where do we go? Probably just, yep, yeah, let's go in there. That looks good. Wait, is it blocked off? You can see the bar at the top slowly decreasing. So what do we do about the sun exposure? Do we just have to wait until it gets better? Repair the mine entrance to descend down into the mines. Aha, okay, makes sense now. Thank you. That's what we need. We need bolts. We need all of that. And I feel like we just have to go down there until we found all of that stuff. Ankle hurting. Oh, can't run like this. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh shit. This is not good. Oh, we're okay. We're okay in here. Oh my gosh. Whew. Unironically, that was one of the most scariest things that's happened to me in a while in a game. It was loud. It was all up in my face. I couldn't take it. Okay, I'm here. Can I fix it? Yes, I can. Beautiful. It's time to go down. Let's go. Down went Alice. Ah! Down went Alice, apparently a little bit too fast. How do we fix this ankle? Can I use a bandage? Just use two, maybe? Ankle looks good. That was easy. Well, let's repair it again and see if we can go down the proper way. Okay, we made it. What the hell is that? It's fine. I'm sure it's nothing, right? Okay, never mind. It's something. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? Ah! Oh, what? Ah! I can't see it. I can't see it. Okay, it can't get me up here, I don't think. Where do I go then? I guess down here? Oh my god! You know what? I'm just running. No, not easy, does it? Okay. Okay, bro. This is this is unfair. Let me up, let me up. Whew. I don't know what I'm doing. I have no idea. I think I have to go that way. Nope. This is just clean water. <gasps> come on, come on. I, I can't go. I can't go. Ah. I can't sprint. I hate this. <sighs> Pickaxe. Wooden handle. Oh, I need glue. All right, now we got another knife. Now we should be able to make... Okay. Are you ser Are you serious? Can they not see me in the dark? I don't I don't know what's going on. Okay, wooden handle. We have no Oh my god. We have nothing. We we can't. I have no chance. I may as well let it kill me. I honestly, I may as well let it kill me. I hate this. You have no idea how much I hate this. I don't know why. I'm shivering. I'm shivering. I why can't I see the animals? All I need is a pickaxe, please. I hate it here. I hate it here so much. Get me through. You know, I'm so low on hunger, I'm gonna die anyway. I have to eat it. I have to eat whatever this is. Barely loaded. Looks like they left this place in a hurry. Okay, we've made it pretty far. And that is the exit, surely. Have I made it? Please. Please. Oh my. Okay. Back there again. Yes. Soon. Why? Why did we do that? I need to get down there and then I can sleep, but it's going to take me a little while. It's going to be a close call. That is a big town, though. Holy shit, that was stressful. I don't care about the radio at this point, though. I need a bed. I need to sleep. Can you not see? It's clearly bedtime. Oh, yes. Yes. I don't care. It's time to sleep. Oh, my God. That was a long day. Okay, I'm back. It's now the following day. I've had some sleep, and I think I'm ready to complete Arid. I remember we were halfway through exploring this place and went to bed. Let's hope there aren't any enemies, and I'm just gonna look through every single house, I guess. Explore Bodega, Explore Taberna, Explore Formatia. These are all different houses. I see. Ooh, Metal Hook. Wait. This is the bodega. How have I not been in the bodega? 
Yep, there we go. All done. All right, well, let's rehydrate. I wish there was a bed so we could sleep because that is like ideal right now. Let's quickly drink one of them, eat some food. All right, fill up the canteen. Oh no, it's dirty water. Bro, are you serious? Okay, oh, there is a bed actually. Let's use it. Save and wake up and it's nighttime. That is where we need to go though. All right, I guess that is what we will do. And hopefully there's a water filter over there. Okay, so where did they move to? The notes mentioned a cave somewhere close to the cactus farm. Oh, is that the cactus farm? That is the cactus farm for sure. And then this is the cave. Gardener's letter, two out of three. We might have been discovered, but it doesn't matter anymore. Something happened at the plant, something terrible. I've been waiting for you, but you never came. The plant. So are we gonna go to a factory, I wonder? Okay. There better not be animals. Oh. Looks like they drag themselves here. Show me something good, game. We have a pickaxe? Yes, we do. And this is the end. Okay. Oh, pickaxe. Did we use ours? Yes, we did. Okay. Well, we got a new one. Oh, and we're out. There's, these are a lot of graves. Holy shit. All right, I'm going to move quickly because I definitely don't want to miss the plane. Is that where that is on the marker? I'm guessing it is. Gotta get cool before I drop. Oh, shit. Yep, you're right. So what do I do? Have to climb through or what? I do have a pickaxe though. Never mind, I do not. Does anyone have a pickaxe for me? Wait, I do. I do have a pickaxe. What do you mean I don't have a pickaxe? I don't understand. Oh, my energy's low. Let's go to sleep then. Now let's break through. Nice. And again, another one. Am I going to need a second pickaxe? Pickaxe has officially broken. Well, there's a shovel, but it's not going to help me. Uh, I don't have a pickaxe. Bit of a sticky situation. I'm so surprised that there's not like another pickaxe laying around. Okay, rope. Strong rope. Improved hammer. Yes. Pickaxe! We did it. We did it. Please say this is enough. If this isn't enough, I don't know what to do. I can't keep my eyes open. How many uses have we got? Four more or three more. I don't know how it works. I can't. Finally. We made it. Oh my god, yes. Repair the broken stairs and gain access to the super plant. <gasps> Pronto. What do you mean? Why are you talking? There's a guy. We need wood. We need wood. That's it. Yes. Yes. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, we're good. Woo. I made it. Explore the saltpeats factory for resources. Honestly, I kind of wish I had like a backpack maybe so that I could carry more. Oh, sofa. That's something new. Explore the factory though is a pretty vague instruction. I wonder what they want us to find. Be able to craft a flare gun with these tools. Well, there you go. A flare gun. So over the next two or three hours, I just tried my best to craft a flare gun and it wasn't easy. But over time, I gradually got closer and closer until I eventually completed it. Well, there's one thing. Metal frame. Oh my God. Hello. Oh my God. It's a source of water. <gasps> okay. Where am I going to get coal? Okay. Thank you. That was very, very easy. And now I should be able to craft pretty much everything I need for a flare. <laughs> I have done it, ladies and gentlemen. It's time to go set off the flare up there. Yeah, you already know, Arrow. You know where I'm going. Honestly, the relief I feel right now. I'm so happy. Yep. Yep. I'm sure. I'm very, very sure. Why is there just... Uh, oh, okay. Please, please, please. It has to work. Oh, shit. 
shit. <laughs> Did it work? I, I saw a plane. We did it. Now that was a journey. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you subscribe and watch this video next.